Welcome to the biggest food festival in Africa. We are at the GTCO Food and Drinks Festival, an annual exhibition showcasing a diverse range of food businesses. The event is free and lasts for three days. Join us as we embark on a culinary adventure exploring authentic flavors, street foods and cooking masterclass. Keep watching so you don't miss out on this delicious adventure. Please like this video and subscribe if you are new to the channel unless you believe Ghana Jellof is better than Nigerian Jellof. So subscribe. Can't avoid. We arrived early, around 10 am, and most vendors were still setting up their stands. The outdoor section featured street food and authentic Nigerian cuisine like akara, bolly fish, native soup, and a lot more. Big jazzy. <laughs> There is a cozy sitting area to relax or enjoy your meals with family and friends. For now. Not like the pizza, but I think we may have to. That's the exit and entrance. The indoor section offered a wider variety of food options. The abundance of food was overwhelming. I 
I just forgot about the rest because there's so many foods everywhere. If you give, say, like, let's say, 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 there's something I actually want to try, that cutting candy. Do you know when I try that? That cutting candy always looks like um, like blue. When you walk in, just be careful. Yeah, it's pink, red, and everything. We finally settled to get some snacks. After chilling outdoors for a while, the heat outside drove us back indoors. There is a game area we wanted to check out, but the waiting line was too long. So you can also come to immediately enter, main entrance, walk left, one looking right. I swear it wasn't open. The box track. They have gone. I swear. Amazing. Delicious pop up. Like never before. Now, just before I jump back into these announcements, I would like to let you know. Line is too long. Should we just. The masterclass that starts at 1 pm. Okay. The yeah. doors are open. Class. Are you back there? You are passing now. Not Okay, it's fine. Focus.
I tried cutting candy for the first time and it was interesting. It tasted kind of like flavored air. Next up, we attended the International Chef's Masterclass hosted by Chef Gil Gand. We received a lovely bag with a brochure, fan and apron in it. We learned how to make creamy chocolate desserts and valuable tips during the hour-long session. Now, I'm going to ask everyone to put their hands together. This is someone that has traveled the entire world going for different food festivals. But we are honored to have her here today at the GT Co. Food and Drink Festival 2024. Put your hands together for Chef Gail. Small pieces or getting fussy, just kind of busting it wherever it wants. 
So in the States, we have something called the James Beard Award. It's kind of like an Oscar for the movies. Does that oh, translate even? So it might work for So one is for Outstanding Pastry Chef. And one was for Best Service at My Fancy Pants Fine Dining Restaurant True. I have to put it all in at once. You can come back and refill it. But you can see I'm holding the bag with my C-shaped hand from that right hand. Afterwards, the crowd had grown even much larger and the aroma of food filled the air. It's a season of discounts, ladies and gentlemen. It's raining discounts, baby. Discounts here and there. All right, so all of the vendors here today are offering massive, massive discounts that you want to take advantage of. So please make your way to your favorite vendors. I mentioned earlier that I think that we are having a pop pop war going on. And the radio booth will be the judge of who will or who makes the best pop pop at Cutie Cook Food and Drink 2024. So bring on your best pop pop recipe and let us be the judge of how this war is going to go down live at Beautiful Food and Drink 2024. And if you misplaced your ATM card, a GT card belonging to Olayemi or Latsunji, please make your way to the radio booth with some proof of ownership and pick up your GT card here at the radio booth, Olayemi or Latsunji. All right, let's also give you this quick information. Very quickly, we have the Taste Adventure Campaign. Yes, there is a Taste Adventure Campaign, and it's coming from Squad Adventure. Squad presents the Squad Adventure. One more time, it's Taste Adventure Campaign. I bet you're wondering what it's all about. Well, let me tell you about it very quickly. Uh, for the Taste Adventure, which I believe you are, the GT Co Food and Drink Festival is not but just an event. It's actually a journey of the senses. So, Squad, I bet you know Squad. Squad is everywhere. Take a look around, you see Squad. If you just walk into the hall, Squad is right in. We struggled to choose what to eat, but finally settled at Buka Hut.
as the heat became more unbearable, we decided to head to Langemark Beach to cool off. This was an incredible experience. And until next time, stay safe and stay blessed.